Reshape continuously works to improve the user experience of our products. As part of your subscription, as an existing user with 3Shape, you will get access to three software upgrades each year. In this video, we will take you through the new and improved Implant Studio 2017. In 2017, we have focused on making Implant Studio more intelligent and intuitive, so you can plan your implant cases faster. We are also extending our support of third-party hardware, including additional 3D printers from Formlabs and Bego. Let's take a look at the changes. When you start a new case in Implant Studio 2017, you start by choosing who to send the case to. Either you want to produce the surgical guide in-house, or you choose to send the guide for production at a lab or a guide service provider. You then enter the case details and choose the teeth and indications you will be working with. When entering the anatomy design step, you will find several improvements. You will, for instance, find that neighboring crowns are always placed together. And the contacts tool has been improved to create great contacts easier and faster. The panoramic curve is now proposed by the software, so you only have to review the proposal and move to the next step. You can always edit the software's initial proposal if needed. The software will also propose an initial alignment of the CBCT scan and the surface scan. You just need to check the alignment with the difference map, which is automatically turned on as an added safety precaution and a faster workflow. If you're happy with the alignment, click Next, confirm the alignment and move to the next step. If you have included a pre-preparation scan to your case, you can also decide whether you want the software to align the scans either to the pre-preparation scan or to the preparation scan. At the implant planning step, we have implemented some smaller changes to enable you to go through cases more efficiently. A new grid mode is available for a better overview of the scans. The layout preferences can be adjusted and will be stored for each user. A new bone density feature has also been added, which makes it easier to choose the right implant and position while considering the intended outcome. We display the densities according to the MISH scale, with D1, which is high density, as grey, down to D4, low density, as yellow. Densities below the MISH scale are displayed as black. When you have finalized your case, you will have access to the drill protocol from the approval step, once you have approved the planning. We will soon be releasing another update to Implant Studio, enabling direct 3D printer integration into the Implant Studio workflow, making in-house printing of surgical guides much easier for all supported 3D printers. For now, we support optimized settings for several 3D printers, enabling a faster workflow. In this version of Implant Studio, we have added optimized settings for the Form 2 printer from Formlabs and the Vasio printer from Bego. This was what's new in Implant Studio 2017. Thank you for watching.